Damian Lillard is one of the most loyal players in the NBA. You always see the quotes about him not running from the grind and all that stuff, but I don't care about all that. It's time for him to leave. He's going to the Lakers in an unrealistic trade because I feel like if Dame was with LeBron and AD, they'd go crazy. And honestly, I'm not very optimistic that he's going to win anything in Portland. So finally, Damian Lillard's going to have a real chance at a ring alongside LeBron James and Anthony Davis. We're doing this in a start today, which means the Lakers are going to have a bit of a hold to climb out of right now i think they're the 13th seed in the west so it is gonna be rough but they, they should be able to do it they got three all-stars on the roster dame lebron ad so i think that they definitely have a chance at least to be a play-in team maybe even a playoff team by the end of the season luca's mvp is anybody surprised tyce jones six man of the year yo they made nick claxton insane in the new roster update he is an 85 overall now Braun is the highest in the game now. He's at 98. This roster update that was recently added to the game was insane. And I feel like they gave a lot of players their respect. A guy like Nick Claxton, who's been having a good year, I feel like usually wouldn't be an 85 in 2K, but W to 2K for giving some of those more underrated players appreciation. We're in the play-in tournament, and we end up losing in the second round of it. We can't make the eighth seed as LeBron James has a pretty tough game, only 10 points. But there's no way LeBron is only taking nine shots in a game. Also, we signed Miles Bridges, so there's that. But after the play-in L, we still have three 90-plus players. We made some off-season additions, including signing Devontae Graham. I'm not sure why we gave him so much money, but... We, we did it. Uh, I guess it worked out. We're doing pretty solid this season. And also, if you go on to enjoy the video, subscribe to the channel, man. I'm trying to hit 5,000 subscribers soon. I appreciate all y'all's support for real, man. And we got LeBron on All-NBA 2nd, AD on All-NBA 3rd, AD's on All-Defensive 2nd. A good year individually for those guys. And also, Damian Lillard took over on the scoring front, being the leading scorer for the team. We had Thomas Bryan and RJ Hampton out there scoring for us. Really like that pickup of RJ Hampton we actually ended up making a couple mid-season trades this year trading Alec Burks in the second round pick for RJ and Vic Reeves for PJ Dozier everything's automated though so I'm not controlling what the team does I like those moves to be honest all right we're facing the Grizzlies this is going to be a tough first round matchup in real life they're doing well but ever since that L to the Lakers five game losing streak Shannon Sharp the Shannon Sharp curse is here and the Lakers are going to a game set with the Memphis Grizzlies and they end up winning by four points in a close one. I know L YouTuber, I should have hopped in, but we didn't even have any guys score above 20 points. Still got the dub though. Devontae Graham had a good game in this one, but he's kind of been selling. The efficiency's been bad. Job with only 25 and 12. That's not going to be enough. We're moving on against the eight seeded Mavs. It's Luka, man. Y'all should have expected it. It's Luka. You give him any players. Put me on the team. He's still going to win the MVP. Play me at the five. He's still winning MVP. MVP, all right. So we went ahead and beat them in five games. They upset the one C, but we're better than the one C. We're the, we're the best in the league. We got Braun, we got AD, we got Dame. And now it is a Steph versus LeBron matchup, a Steph versus Dame matchup, a really cool one here. And we have a back and forth series. So in game five, we're going to see if we can get some gameplay, and we get exactly that. Damian Lillard is up at the top of the key trying to make a move. He gets a screen from Anthony Davis, pulls the three. It's Dame time. Check your watch. It's Dame time. He hit the three. He did it. It's, they're up by one. And Steph Curry, oh, man, is it the 2016 finals? He's folding. He's folding like a piece of paper. Here goes Austin Reeves. He's bringing up the ball. He passes it over to Dame. It's Dame time. Check your watches. You know what time it is. He did it. He did it. The Lakers are moving on. It's all over. We don't even need to see any more. Damian Lillard comes up huge for the Lakers in the clutch and the Lakers are moving on. Oh wait, no, they got one more game. But my bad, my bad. But I think out all the momentum, they're winning game 6-2. It, it's over. The Lakers, they're going to the NBA Finals. I feel like Dame deserves the conference MVP just for those two buckets he had right there. Those were insane. And in the final game, it's Damian Lillard again, 32. Ben Simmons shows up in the closeout game. He's on the Warriors. They probably traded Clay for him. I feel like they always trade Clay in these simulations. Now we got the Sixers, who picked up John Collins. Really like that pickup for them. But Daniel House at the three at a 73 overall. That's kind of a weak link for them. We'll see. No disrespect to Daniel House. He would give me a bucket, but... 
yeah, they're, they're still cooking us anyway. They win in five games. Sixers Harden does his best Houston Harden impression as he puts up some crazy numbers in the finals. And after the season, Anthony Davis decided to leave the team. And y'all really thought we were going to allow that. Yeah, AD, get back here. Why would a guy leave his team after going to the NBA Finals? He went to the Toronto Raptors, who actually have Kawhi Leonard back on the team in this. Kind of crazy, but they, they were just stealing all of the LA team's players. But yeah, we're not allowing that. Anthony Davis is once again back. Braun, All-NBA second team, 40 years old, still hooping, man. That is crazy. All right, man. Let me stop making everything about LeBron, but LeBron is crazy, man. If y'all if y'all have time to tune into the games and see him play, the stuff he does at his age is just crazy. Damian Lillard, AD, and LeBron all had good years. I would have expected a little more from AD, but we've got a good supporting cast, so it didn't really matter. In the first round, we've got the Toronto Raptors. That is an easy win. And also, the playoffs went to a 1-16 through 16 seed format. Do you think the NBA should do that in real life? Let me know in the comments section if you're still watching. All right, let's go ahead and let's see what happens. Wait, why would I say if you're still watching? How would you know if you weren't watching? I don't know, man. We're moving on to the conference finals where we have the New Orleans Pelicans. Zion playing center. I like this out of 2K, how they're, how they're like revolutionizing with the small ball lineups because teams do that. I like how they how they put Zion at the five. That, that's cool. That's cool. All right, we go ahead and get off to a 2-0 lead, 3-0. Yeah, get them out of here. They're, they're cooked. We're out of here. Five-game series win, and it's a Lakers-Celtics five. Finals, a classic. Oh my goodness. Aren't they tied in rings right now? So this would be to beat the tiebreaker. See who could get more rings. Let's see what happens here though. In game number one, we win. Game number two, we win. Are they any match for us? Well, maybe. Yeah, they take the next two games. So we're going to hop into the same cast for game number five, where we absolutely dominate, winning by almost 20 points. And it's Braun, man. 37 points, 11 assists in a big game. The big three showed up for this game, but over Overall in the playoffs, our guys have been showing up. As you can see, their numbers have all gone up, at least in the scoring department for the NBA playoffs, which is absolutely great to see. Let's see if we can close out the Boston Celtics, though, because Jason Tatum, he's on fire. But although there is no I in team, Tatum says, yeah, there's a T in team. That was real corny. But y'all should still subscribe if you're still watching. All right, please, please. We're trying to hit 5K. This is the second time I've asked. I'm desperate. Oh, yeah, we won the ring, by the way. LeBron James, your finals MVP. We did it, man. LeBron, he wins the championship with Dame. I really like this squad. But Bron says, nah, I'm not done yet. So we're going to run it back at least another year we'll see what happens after this and this JT Ward guy actually pretty solid 77 overall and 19 maybe he's got some potential we probably won't simulate far enough to see him fulfill that potential though unless Bron plays till he's like 45 LeBron all NBA third team maybe he will just keep going and Anthony Davis all defensive second team haven't really seen Dame and named anything as far as like all NBA teams don't really know why though like he's been hooping for us especially in the earlier seasons Malik Monk is back on the Lakers. Our guys did their thing again. LeBron's the leading scorer of the team. Absolutely crazy to see at his age. But we're down 3-0 against the Magic, and they end up beating us in five. That's an unfortunate way for the season to end, but hopefully we can run it back. Unfortunately, though, LeBron does have other plans. He calls it quits. I would say this video was a success, though. Dame got a ring. Bron got another ring. AD got another ring. Hope y'all enjoyed. Have a great day. Be sure to like and subscribe.